Okay, and we're back. Game two. We're gonna mix it up here. Mix in it up. Um, how do we deal with this? All right. The thing is, I really want to get Trick Room up. I really, really do. I wish I had physical ground on it. It'd be much better in this case than uh, special. I'm gonna go with this. He could just lead Xerneas, so that's not great. Eh. Would he, though? I don't know. I'm not sure what this team, what my team does against a team like his. I'll have to ask the person who made this team what I'm supposed to do in this situation because, quite frankly, I'm not sure. Okay, so he, he, he just goes for it. He wants that Geo. Okay, so what I could do here. I kind of want to bait him not geomancying. I don't know. But he goes with Xerneas. Kang is gone. This is a risky switch, of course. But I just expect to fake out into a Veltal and a Geo. And if that's the case, we're not in a bad position at all. A double into Cresselia won't take it out. Not with the Intimidate. He does fake out into... Yes! We called it! Yes. Go for that Geo. Go for that Geo. I'm not even not worried about the crit. Go for the Geo. Okay. We call one thing right. So now he's got to feel friend. He's got to feel friend. Okay. He does have... Okay, so... Thing is, he's still not in a bad position at all. The question is, does he protect? Does he protect Xerneas? It's a 50 50. He's got to protect it. I've got a Mawile. Okay. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna make a hard call here. And I'm gonna iron head into the. Do I want or do I want? No. In case he protects, I want to get Groudon in here. And I really, I think he's gonna protect. I'm going after the Kangaskhan. That protect, like, please protect. Kangaskhan does have fake out. Friggin' fire punch. I'm guessing it doesn't have sucker punch then. Okay, into Groudon. Into Amoongus. Fudge. Yeah, he's in a good position. He must have known I would have won a trick room this time. He must have known. He does protect, so we get that right. Still doesn't help us that much. That does a saucy amount of damage. The question is, okay, so what does he do here? You spore someone. Who do you spore? You spore them all out. You spore, or you spore the Groudon. Or do you just Rage Powder? You know what? I, I, I feel like he's going to Rage Powder. I think protecting here with Mawile is just... That's my instinct. My instinct is to protect with Mawile. I don't know why. It just feels right. Okay, yes. Into the wrong thing. I thought he would Rage Powder. It's got Substitute. Okay.
Okay, so here... Ooh. If I let him spore me now... I'll go to sleep. Amoongus, okay. I think I have to let him put me to sleep. Okay. He's gonna Dazzling Gleam. But I will take out the Amoongus. Which means I take a turn to sleep here. That crit on the, on the, um... That crit on the Fake Out might actually matter at this point. Because I don't know if I'll survive a Dazzling Gleam. So he doesn't have Moonblast then, does he? Surprise! I thought that Dazzling Gleam would do more to Mawwow. Wombo, here comes the Kang. Trick Room, switching Groudon. Iron-headed, protected, went to sleep. I got one more turn of Trick Room. He has ground on the back, doesn't he? If I could break this sub, that'd be great. I think... Does he protect? I wanna... Yeah, I wanna double into him. He does not protect. That's fine. I guess I should have protected there, but whatever. Maul wakes up. Okay, so I could have potentially gotten uh, broken that sub. But I do have Snarl, but Snarl will miss, because Snarl always misses. This Dazzling Gleam is just doing all kinds of work. And that's the last turn of Trick Room, unfortunately. Yeah. Can Microcellia survive a plus two Dazzling Gleam and a double edge? I don't think so. How do I win this? Substitute Xerneas is doing all kinds of work right now. I have to I have to bring in Yveltal and I have to snarl. I'm guessing that that Kangaskhan is bulky-ish. So I'm going to bet that I outspeed it. And I'm going to snarl. I shall snarl. He withdraws Wombo into who? Okay, into his Groudon. He's gonna outspeed me. And Dazzling Gleam, I should be able to survive it. I'm pretty sure I survive it. Especially if he's got any kind of bulk, I should be able to survive it. Dazzling Gleam. I don't know if I can pick it up. I don't think I can. Definitely not. <laughs> okay. I gotta play my buns off right now to get this. Lock it down. Sucker punch. Probably won't take it out still. Cause he has a, he's not he's not only a plus one, uh, plus one special attack. So, and I took oh he didn't take any damage on the sub. He's not gonna break it. Nah, crap. 
Yeah, and he did. He brought in the Kangaskhan just to prevent me from getting Trick Room up again. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I've got one option here. I don't even think it's worth it. Um, I don't. Do I? I don't. Probably don't even survive. Yeah, I can't survive two dazzling gleams. So he's got it. Unfortunately, he's got it. But I have to go for it. I hope he makes some kind of mistake and like fakes out the ground. But it's not gonna happen. He doesn't have to. He's got a plus two Xerneas behind a substitute. Into the Cresselia. Yeah, he's got it. Man. That was a fun, fun battle. I'm not even mad. That substitute, really. Like, I could have played around it if he didn't have that substitute. That... Wow. Yeah, let's go for Rock Slide. Why not? <laughs> oh, man. He's just... He's just... Insult to injury at this point. <laughs> He's just styling right now. He just wants to show me hammer arm. That's silliness. I love it. Hammer arm. The hammer arm was just for, was for against other trick room because it's already slow enough, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, is that trick room Gengar? Oh wow, that's crazy. Well, hey, that there you go. That's it, guys. Not, I guess, you know, we didn't win, but we sure had a lot of fun. So if you like that, feel free to like, comment, share, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And hopefully I'll see you back for uh, some more stuff on the channel. Hopefully ladder up soon, but who knows.